Hey guys, it's Mike Sorg at Sorgatron for Basic Sorgonomics here. And uh, for this April 23rd, I believe it is 2015, let's talk about public speaking. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Uh, a little post-mortem on my uh, adventures last night. Uh, well, mainly one of my adventures last night. Uh, one of them being uh, the great Patty Swisher down there at Point Park University. Uh, we connected, amazingly enough, on LinkedIn, I think it was. And uh, I was invited into class as a speaker, as a person that does podcasts regularly, to talk to this social media journalism marketing-based class down there. And uh, I was really, uh, yeah, I was really, I'm, I, I, I'm, I'm, I am a glutton for getting in front of an audience, apparently, right now, uh, and I was looking forward to it. And uh, we finally got to that after a little bit of a delay. And uh, here's the thing. Here's the secret. I don't prepare for these things. No, that sounds really bad. Well, I don't prepare for these things either, for the most part. Um, I didn't have an idea exactly what I was going to say, and I still don't right now. I don't even know where this podcast going to go after this. But uh, I... And that's why, you know, there was like, oh, do a 40-minute presentation, 20 minutes of questions, and I don't know, they probably won't answer questions or ask questions or something like that. Um, but for me, it's easy. It's like, what do you want to, okay, what do you guys want to talk about? Like, okay, podcasting, journalism, okay, I got I got an angle on this and thought about a couple of points and, and, and stuff like that. Uh, but this is like, this is what I've been doing. I miss what this show is every morning, is uh, things I'm excited about today. <laughs> And that's what I started calling it a one man show last night afterwards. But uh, that's exactly what it is. I came in and said, uh, hey, this is what I've been doing. And this is what I've been doing for my clients. And this is what I'm excited about. That could be the next thing. We got into a little bit of Meerkat Periscope. I asked if uh, the college students are into Snapchat. Stupid question to ask college students because, of course, they're into it. I pleaded with them to turn their video sideways um, instead of the vertical uh, when they're not in Snapchat or Meerkat or something like that. Wow. Snapchat and Meerkat even kind of sound the same, don't they? And they look the same. And they said that was purely incidental. Um, anyways. Uh, but, you know, I, it was kind of an exercise and challenge for me to say, you know, I just go in there with some, some talking points in the back of your head. I, I feel like um, I've never been a PowerPointer. Um, PowerPointer. <laughs> wow, I need to stop. Uh, but... Uh, I, I, I think it's an exercise. The, the few PowerPoint things I've done have been very minimal. I, I did uh, back a few years ago, I did a five years, what I learned in five years of podcasting. Oh, jeez. So that was almost five years ago. Um, and it was really just kind of pictures and headlines, and I just riffed off of that. It was just kind of read my, it's like I just put my notes on screen and something to entertain people, right? Um, I, 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 I said, never been much for those slideshow presentations. I feel like I've seen too many people crutch on them a little bit, um, you know, be it, you know, some pod camp presentations, be it some medical presentations where they're reading the entire slide. Uh, yeah, yeah, don't read the entire slide. It's more footnotes, more notes. You know, I can just read it. Why am I having you tell me these things? What, what information are you giving me that I couldn't have glommed off of just reading your slideshow on the Internet afterwards, right? What, what is the point of this? What value are you giving as a presenter at this point? Um, and, and for me, you know, I, I tried to be on my toes and, and give some peace of mind and give some, hey, these are the things that you're doing. And these are what these people have done over here. You know, talk about networks like Twit and 5x5, you know, and uh, oh, what did we get into? What was the other one uh, aside from Twit we got into? Ah, it's gonna, oh, I got into Patreon. And that was actually just on the fly. I'm just like, oh, hey, here's another thing you could do. Um, and talking about Todd Merritt's amazing uh, stuff going on over there. And just possibilities. We were kind of played with the idea. I love this. I love this. So I'm, so I'm like, put out some question, you know, ideas for questions. Somebody's like, what about Twitch? And I'm like, what? You know. Uh, and it is interesting. And, and we were kind of ideas. I'm like, like you got to look for these new platforms and new opportunities, you know. Um, yeah, I talked about, I gave a little bit about the, uh, the Meerkat Periscope. If you're there first, you got like a hundred followers just because you were there. And now what did you do to capitalize? I didn't, I, I mean, I'm doing this stuff. I'm still figuring it out, but even the little bit pointing it at the stuff we're doing around here got us like, we got 30 people on your presentation you do every Monday at noon that we never got anybody on Google Hangout. We couldn't find the audience, but the audience is showing up over here because they're just looking for stuff on this platform. Um, that, but what are we doing to keep those people? We just expose those people to what we're doing. How, what are, we, are we doing enough to make them stick around? 
And maybe we did, maybe we didn't. Maybe some of those people followed my client after that. Maybe they didn't, but, but 30, 40 people more, and that's 30, 40 people at a time, but more probably over the course of the thing, uh, know what we're doing, right? Um, but that's, that's a whole other point there. Uh, but, uh, and that's, and that's really what this, this morning thing is, is an exercise. Um, it's probably painfully obvious sometimes that I don't know where I'm going with these. And, but the challenge is for me to get up and talk to you for 10 minutes and see if I get something, see if I can get something engaging out there and get my mind you know, pieces of my mind out there, which is turned into ideas and opportunities of people saying, hey, you talked about that thing. Have you thought about this? Or, hey, you talked about that thing. Would you like to do this thing? You know, um, it's a place to air that. This is my blog. This is my company blog in voice form. And uh, and and it's uh, really, it's been a good angle for me so far, I think. And a good ride since July of last year that I started this thing. Um, and it keeps growing. And it's good to see that. Um, where are we at? Where are we at? Uh, but, uh, so I, I, I gotta tell you with this one part from last night. Um, and this is, you're in a social media class. These guys, this is the other thing that blows my mind here. And I said this in, in the, in the presentation, cause I was talking to uh, Patty beforehand and, and I was like, well, they've had Twitter assignments to do this and get and, and get involved with a, a news news event as it's happening on Twitter and everything. And I'm like, Twitter assignments blows my mind. Like, like really, my assignment is go play on Twitter. <laughs> you know, my assignment is to go. Uh, they have a private uh, Facebook group and everything. They're using these tools. And, like, it just blows my mind that this is like this is the an educational thing. This is people learning to use these tools. Are people getting in on it. Uh, another friend that's uh, uh, engaging with 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 groups online. You know. Uh, it's just, it, it, it's just like this. This is this is how people learn, you know. Versus somebody like me, I guess I've been around since day one and and kind of learned it on my own. I'm past the educational system, but you need something for kids coming up that maybe use the Twitter for fun, maybe use the Snapchat or anything like that, and they get into a lot of uh, speaking with what they're doing down at Point Park. Is you know they're like well, that, but there's also the analytics and there's also this and there's also you know the people part of it, right? Um, there's a lot of angles on it, and uh, and I thought, and I like that that the angle of yesterday's uh, class was journalism and marketing. Like you do one way or another, and it does. Like we talked about yesterday, kind of blend together right now on social media, um, and having those opportunities. So uh, that's my thoughts. If you want to check it out, it uh, looks like the audio was pretty good. I should be posting here uh, along with this, maybe another post over at Sorgatron.com. My presentation from yesterday, uh, talking about all the video podcasting things I, I did with the class. Uh, so you won't get the visuals, but I think I think for the most part you'll get the idea. And hopefully you hear the, the one guy in the class that talked uh, and stuff like that. Um, I'm really glad that I got a new Hearthstone friend out of this. Oh, I didn't finish the one guy. The one guy, he's sitting like right in front of me, nodding when I'm talking about pro wrestling, nodding when I'm talking about some other stuff, in a room full of IMAX, he's sitting there with a Microsoft Surface uh, plugging away at this thing, and uh, and it was the one that asked questions. <laughs> so I found a new friend. Uh, so it was a really cool uh, experience there. And he followed, you know, so he followed me up on Twitter and said, hey, let's play Hearthstone. <laughs> Rock. So... Uh, check me out if you have a uh, question, not question of the day or anything like that, but just what are you excited for? If I could plop you in front of a microphone like this, maybe, maybe like this, high audio people, uh, but if it could put you in front of a microphone and you had 10 minutes to tell me what you're excited about, what, what are you going to tell me about? Or even better, hey, this is going to be a hang off of the hang off. This is going to be a, a, a spin off of last week's video challenge. Give me a video. I want to hear what are you excited about. I will listen to them. Anybody who sends me a 10-minute video of what you're excited for right now, I will listen to it. And I will give you feedback. I promise you that. Um, I'm looking at some of you out there that I know. Listen, a couple of your names begin with Ds. A couple of people perked up at that. We'll see you guys next time. Sorgatron.com, at Sorgatron on the Twitter. Please check out everything going on in the network. Uh, friends, they don't officially sponsor this show yet, but I want to shout out to them because we're going to start doing things network-wide. SliceOnBroadway.com, BoldPittsburgh.com, and, of course, uh, my stuff. If you like pro wrestling, go to IndieWrestling.us. And we'll see you guys next time. 
This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.